back with another video. Um, hopefully you can hear me better this time. Um, since my past videos have been very, very quiet, um, it's just been due to the position, position of my microphone. Um, today I'm doing something a little bit different. Um, you're probably like, finally, something that isn't a Roblox video. Yeah, I know. Uh, Roblox isn't changing at all. It's just going to stay the way it is. And at this point, I'm starting to work around it. I'm just starting to uh, do my own thing with it. But this video isn't about Roblox, obviously. We're going to be talking about um, what's been going on with Norfolk Southern's stored locomotives. Um, so, obviously, you want to go to the current Diesel Loco roster pages. This is where you'll find the main stuff. Um, this list was updated November 14th. Um, it's the 21st today, so it's been like seven days, I think, if I can count. I don't know. <clears throat> but yeah, look at all these stored. Just a whole bunch of stuff stored. We're going to be, I think we're mainly going to be talking about the SD70M-2. I've been wanting to talk about this for a while because the last video I've seen of a Norfolk Southern SD70M-2 was in, it was the 4th of July, so it's been quite a while. So here's the SD70 ACC, 45 Hundred horsepower. I thought it was just four, four thousand. But yeah, here's the SD70 M-2. All 130 out of 130 have been stored. And this is quite weird. You have, you also have the SD70 M's right here, which two out of three categories are all stored. This one only has three left that aren't stored. So we'll go to this. These are like the, um, the more divoted angled nose with the white, basically the horse head schemes with the flared radiators. So if we go down to all of your PTC equip and all that, but it's stored. It says it's stored, but it's still on the active roster. And that says that for most of the stored locomotives. So we're going to go down. Um, actually, I'm going to try to find. I thought I saw something shaded in gray. But. Yeah, all you need to do is go to. So I don't know what they're going to be doing with these. I don't know why they are storing all of these. If they're going to be given. Like. I don't know, do these things have, I don't know if these things have AC traction or not, but if they don't, then that could be what they're doing with these. Other than that, I don't see why they would use these for SD70 ACCs because they got the weird flared radiators, sort of like an SD45 has. But I think these ones flare out just a tiny bit less. But yeah, only three are left that are, one is assigned to AR, AR Transportation Technology. Um, try and go down here. 2629 isn't assigned to anything. It's, it's still going. So. I don't think I see any more. Yeah, 2629, 2603, and then 2595. So those are the only ones that are still out. And as you can see, it's gray, which means it's pending to store some more. I don't know why they're trying to store all of these. My only real guess as to why they're storing the SD70M-2s is so um, it's one of the three things, I think. They're either 
Or it could be four things, five things maybe. You got number one, they could be rebuilding for AC traction. Two, they could be retired or sold to a different railroad. Three, they're rebuilt, they're using their cabs for SD70 ACCs and ACU, which would be number four. Um, and then number five, they could just be entirely using the unit for something else, like just using all of its parts for maybe a new IAC. They could be doing that, I don't know. But yeah, kind of sucks. All of the SD70 standard cabs are stored. You won't see any more. These are the only four left that aren't rebuilt. Well, in this category. Then you have the other 24 right here. So yeah. Everything under this number, I think, is pretty much rebuilt already. We can go to the, um, right here. These are what the SD70 standard cabs are being rebuilt as. They're adding these really weird <clears throat> tier four SD70 ACE cabs to them, which I don't mind. I mean, it doesn't look normal to me. There's 1807. And it says here what was rebuilt. 2505. That was um, that was one of my favorites right there. Not my top favorite, but 2505 was rebuilt twice actually. Um, it was originally in the regular stripe uh, Norfolk Southern scheme with the black number boards, um, not number boards, but the back, black, shoot, I can't talk, the black facing front, <clears throat> and that was when it had a P3 horn, then they rebuilt it, gave it the horse head scheme, and that's when it had a K5HL, a really sick K5HL, then they rebuilt it again, into 1802. Then we can go back, we can go down to, there's 2504, 2501. I think I saw that one day. Let me see if I can find it. My favorite one here. Oh, it would be down here. It's in the pending. Right here, 2502. It's going to be rebuilt as 1845. Not yet completed. It sucks because this was my favorite SD70. It had a really cool um, alternating S3L that just really cool. Um, where are we at? Almost nine minutes now, so this video might take a while to upload. We could keep going. I'm just gonna name this video Norfolk Southern Rebuilds. The SD75M, which was very a very rare locomotive to see on the Norfolk Southern. Not one I usually see. I don't think I've seen any either. Rebuilt. Yeah, all the Dash 940Cs are gone. Um, all the top hats are gone on Norfolk Southern. They've either been retired or put under the AC44C6M. This was a complete failure. The Dash 8.540CW. This was sort of something that Canadian National would have done with their Dash 9s. Except they used their Canadian cabs. I think Norfolk Southern sort of had that same idea, but put an SD60 E cab on it. But yeah, this was just. They're all stored. This one's. 
undergoing huh so they're adding another one which was a dash 840c weird but yeah i think that's gonna be it for this video it's already 10 minutes um i can't go further than 15 so i'm just gonna stop here thank you guys for watching um i appreciate it and if you guys want to see some more stuff uh subscribe and i might do something different next time i don't know we'll see but yeah that's gonna be it i'll see you all in the next video ta-ta